Okay, everyone, so I came up uh, this morning and the flowers open up on the squash. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I do. Um, because when you have the squash growing, if it doesn't get pollinated, it won't develop into a squash. It will eventually kind of looks like a blossom end rot. Um, so anyhow, I have uh, these Q-tips and I'm just gonna take and get the pollen from the flower, the male flower. Try and get, I don't know, hopefully a bee did get to it because there is really like hardly any pollen. Okay, here is another plant. Um, it's the yellow squash. So this one does have pollen on it quite a bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take it over to the other one because none of the females on this one are um, open. And that will just ensure that it gets pollinated. And there's times I've actually just removed the male flower and just take it and rub it on to the female. And then as the season goes on, um, hopefully I get more bees, but uh, anyhow, just wanted to share that with you. And it was a perfect opportunity to show you, you know, if you have to manually pollinate, um, that's what you do.